Hello, and welcome back to the ICU doc. This is Tamaris Baranos, and here's another lecture on transthoracic critical care echo. In today's presentation, we'll talk about the apical four chamber view, how to get it, and the structures we're looking at. After acquiring the parastinal short axis images, the apical window is next to be interrogated. Place the probe at the point of maximal impulse near the fifth intercostal space at the mid axillary line, with the ultrasound beam pointing towards the right shoulder and the indicator of the probe pointing towards the three o'clock position. You should be getting an image looking like this. Note that the left ventricle should be about two thirds and the left atrium should be about one third of the entire longitudinal axis of the heart. The apex should be elliptoid in shape and if the left ventricle is foreshortened, the apex will appear a little bit more rounded. To optimize your image, you may have to reposition the patient at the left lateral decubitus position. Let's talk about the structures we're looking at. You have the left ventricle, the left atrium, the mitral valve. On the opposite side, you have the right atrium, the right ventricle, and between those two structures, you have the tricuspid valve. The interatrial septum will be between the right atrium and the left atrium. Note that in this particular case, because of the angle that the ultrasound beam slashes the heart, this part of the septum will be the inferior septal wall, and the part of the lateral wall of the left ventricle will be the anterior lateral wall. On the right ventricle, you have the right ventricular free wall or the lateral wall. The left ventricle is also divided into equal thirds perpendicular to the long axis of the heart. This generates three sections. The basal, which is closer to the valve. The mid cavity, which includes the papillary muscles and the apex. Thank you all for watching. Make sure you check out our website, YouTube channel and follow us on Twitter to get updates when new videos come out. Also, if you like the lectures, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and share.